Hey everybody, it's Bluetooth and welcome back to Pikmin 4. Also, I'd like to point out the top of the screen also has the amount of cures that we have ready for the next, uh, what's it called? Leaflings we get. But anyway, let's go back to exploring. And see what else we can get now. We've got more Pikmin and we've completed a lot more areas. And we have a lot more Pikmin numbers and just stuff overall now, so... We should be pretty good. We're already at 40%, so we can probably clear out this area a fair bit. We only have half of the treasures here. So that's something. <laughs> that's crazy. Actually crazy. Anyway, I say that a fair bit at the moment for some reason. It's the current phrase. You know what I mean. That's also another one. <laughs> Too many phrases that you repeat all the time. I mean, it's fine. That's also... It's, yeah, it, don't worry about it. They're all just overcrowding. They all just come one after another. But... Hmm. Anyway. That's another one. I just, I just can't get out of it. I'm stuck in a loop of only... Uh... Things. You know what I mean? It's fine, I'm stuck it's back in the beginning. No! I'm going downhill fast. If I start... Saying the same thing again, just... Stop watching, I don't know. Leave before it's too late, before the loop consumes us all. Just gonna overcrowd it with stuff, because I can. I think I will move the base down though. Probably. Also, did I lose a Pikmin just then? I think it just got stuck on something. Unfortunately for me. Also, this thing's annoying. It eats from the front, we can hit its weak spot on the back. Also, apparently it does that. Poisoning our Pikmin with ink. Need to be careful. More careful than I am being. Just gonna take it out though. So we don't have to worry about it. Overall, it's just a good idea to kill all these enemies. Get on board. Maybe we should also... No, that's actually probably a bad idea to move the Pikmin across because there's a thing in the way. The enemy. And I don't want them getting... ...grabbed by it. Move the base. Now let me take care of that enemy that I was talking about. And then maybe we'll get them going down this way. This thing. Please target. Just call them back off. Okay, good fight, good fight. Good start to the fight anyway. There's also this wall I want to get rid of. Well, sweet, really? Oh, I guess actually we can probably get the watermelon now. It's good to think about. Uh, let's hopefully be fine with this. Get that. Uh, maybe get some of this other stuff as well. So what are you doing? You're fine somehow, but what are you doing to me? Okay, that's good. Get that. I don't know if I should get all of this stuff, but I don't know. So there's this thing here as well. Is this actually a thing, or is that just only when there's other stuff? Maybe, like, that might be just a different hole that it goes into, possibly. Which, if that's the case, that's fine. Uh, please don't. Oh, that was close. That works for me. That's how you want to do it, probably. Uh, but I want to get... ...this. Which also, the, the blue Pikmin can swim around, which is really cool. They don't have to go... Like, they don't have to go across the ground to get to where they want to. They can actually just swim to whatever they're going for. Call the Pikmin off. That was somehow fine. This enemy is just plain annoying. As always. Just 
Just don't let it slam your Pikmin down, because it'll eat them. Hit it when its defense is open. Summer Fruit Series, nice. Also, don't I think it dies? Or maybe it does. I guess it does, in this one. It usually doesn't, in previous games, so... Guess that's something to be careful for going backwards. To all the games. That's not quite what I had in mind. That's fine. Just fine. Maybe we should go get a Pikmin and get that watermelon if we can. Although I think the tide has to go down first, so let's just wait on that for now. And we take out this other enemy over here. <coughs> and then we'll figure out what to do next. It's fine. Works for me. This is going well, surprisingly. We've had some trouble in this area, so I am surprised I'm doing better, somewhat. Just charging things seems to work out for me. It's not gonna work now, but let me try. Nope, they're getting some. Please change target. Come on. Got it. Wasn't great, but we got him. Need to get better at this. I will over time. Also, Ochi coming with us is kind of like a bit pointless. Honestly. Come on, please, thank you. I need to also be careful with this fish again. Got it. Nice. Let's get this fruit. And let's get this grape, which we have to take apart piece by piece. And the Pikmin will go back and forth between it. No, they won't. What? It's changed. I would like that, though. Oh, well. They did that in Pikmin 3, anyway. Let's get this other stuff back. Just because we can. The spoils of war. We also need to break down this gate here and explore this huge area. Let's switch and tell Ochi to go home, basically. Also, there's a bunch of stuff up there that I forgot to go get. There's also a Pikmin over there to go get as well. Maybe it would be a good idea to move the base again. Possibly. Or maybe I'll just figure it out and get good. I can also... call some Pikmin over. If they're done, and just sitting around. Probably worthwhile. Also, since we're going into the deep water, it'll be really cool. Since we'll be probably having the camera under underground. Underwater, that one. Same thing, basically. But it might be just easier to be able to see things. A little bit closer. Oh boy. They're a bit high up. Please, get him. Thank you. They struggled with that because they don't really go for it immediately. But I think I should be probably charging those a bit more. Like, actually charging them. Hey! That's interesting. There's a thing in here. Low tide. That's probably good for us. A little bit. Want to get this flalic. Kind of a bit close, but it means I'll do more damage. Do I have enough Pikmin? Yes, I do. So why are they struggling? I don't know. This is some really cool terrain. Like, really cool. Yeah, too many things. Let me actually... 
Call some more Pikmin. Nope. Call some more Pikmin over. And probably also switch. Because I think at some point I want to get Ochi to change the base. Maybe? Look at the map again. Oh, uh, we've yet to go up that way. Which is interesting. I think we have to go through there. This is that uh, cave there that we need to go through. And that cave there. Which I probably want to do today. If I can manage it. Why is that like that? The Pikmin just is stuck there, apparently. Also, the, the struggling character? Or something? I don't know. Let me see if I can... What's happening? Where are the Pikmin struggling? Oh, there. Pikmin, no. Where did this crab come from? Real question. Oh well. I was hoping to get more stuff down that way. But we'll just get the rest of this probably for the moment. Maybe get that, um... What's it called? The watermelon. Oh, it's just sitting on that. That's why it's stuck. Okay. That's fine. Here's another one. There's just so many things around. Also, this does bring us up to 80 now? I think so. We can take out 10 more Pikmin now. This should speed up our search. And she just arrived at destination. Um... Just think about this. There's something here, so I probably want to unbury it. But I think I need white Pikmin for that. So maybe let's move the onion. In a second. Have to pluck some more Pikmin out. That's fine. We have so many Pikmin. Okay, let's put some of these away. And sand you. There-ish, I guess, or over there. Okay, move base. Whoa. I didn't expect that. But I'll take it, I guess. I really was not expecting that. It moved my people across. Well, that's something I'm going to have to keep in mind, because that is going to be super helpful if we can keep that up. Let's get that. But also... Send out some of you here. I think this is the spot, right? Should be. Unless it's... Oh, it's the watermelon. Okay. I'm just crazy. And I'm wasting a bit of time, that's okay. There's also a thing down here. Let's dig that up. Just like that. Very nice. Probably should have actually... Oh my goodness, Ochi's so strong. Probably should have actually... Uh, take an Ochi to go get the thing. Which I can still do. And we're going this way anyway. So, let's get it. Nice. That's a big thing. In Pikmin 3, you had to carry get a watermelon as well, but you had to carry it in like several pieces. Which is also pretty cool. But now we're actually taking it in one big piece. Is that all the things we need to get up here? It is. It's almost worthwhile changing the base again. So... Let's figure out where we want to move it. Thinking over here probably again. I 
I just let that go. There's also a water spout thing there that I haven't taken care of. That's fine. This place has changed a lot since we've started this day. We we'll probably want to go into a cave soon though. Nuggets there. Treasure recovered. Very nice. If it moves the thing with everything else, I should probably just leave them up there. Let me switch. Just see how this is going. Now I'll transport it. I was thinking about going to get more Pikmin, but I'm just going to let them transport it. Probably. I really need to move the base though, so I can do other stuff. That's concerning every time that happens. I should have moved the base first, probably. Honestly, but I thought since the other stuff was going up anyway, it'd be fine. Even if I call these Pikmin, it's not going to be really faster. Doing it. Just going to expand. Transport. Slightly faster, maybe. Running out of time. Going to switch so I can be ready. Also, hang on. Yeah, I also changed my name in the stylist thing, because you can do that. So I'm now Jeremy instead of Blue Toad. <sighs> Just like that. That's crazy. Not sure if I'm going to be able to get into it now, since it's getting so late. Is the problem. I mean, there's that one down there, which is underwater, which is concerning. For obvious reasons. Also, I kind of want this. Well, that's a shame. A little emergency call if we need to. Even if I, they don't get it back, I can do something, I guess. I don't know. At least it's a little bit closer. Is that Leafling again? And if the the figure lying down over there must be our pilot. Must just be our pilot. You'd hope so, but um maybe you wouldn't hope so. This is no joke. They could be turned into a leafling. What are you waiting for, newbie? Hurry up and save him. It's pretty close. I think I'm going to enter. Pikmin present, yellow. Interesting. And then when we come back out, when it's 10 seconds left, we'll try and get it back. If that makes any kind of sense. It's not perfect, but even if we don't, we have the next day to get it back. Three star difficulty. Okay. Dendori Castle. Here we go. I believe. Yeah, the Pikmin are excellent diggers. But they're not great with fighting. I've been waiting for you. I now have a new rule that I will use to test you. I will explain it in time. Let us begin. Everything's fine. It's weird not having the full screen. Very weird. Really? Fine. That's really not good for me. Not a great start. So I kind of want this. Please beat it up. It's fine. Let's get that back. We need a significant score. Oh, item capsules? This is a mystery capsule. 
Oh no. As you know, now know, Dandori is part luck. This is an item of mystery, so you cannot know what will emerge from its depths. If you use these items, your Dandori will succeed. Pick up as m pick up many. Use many. This feels like a... I don't know how to feel about this, honestly. It's something to keep track of, but also... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Boulders. I think it sends it onto the enemy, so that's probably good. Probably want to time it better than that, though. What's is that there? Interesting. I want to try and take that out. Bonus find can help a lot. Plus Pikmin. Very nice. Well worthwhile. Please hurry up. Interesting. Needs to be doing a little bit better than this. Oh, hello. Interesting. Oh my goodness, golden fruit as well. This is a gold sni golden sniffer. It is heavy, and its value is high. A rare treasure indeed. If you can collect this, it will carry you closer to victory. It's right here and as well, in this corner. Also, this is now valuable, so let's get that. And get these. How much is this worth? 30. Interesting. I don't have enough Pikmin. And also, I think my score is getting really bad compared to theirs. They're stealing my stuff. I'm possibly using items a lot. I really can't tell. Also, Ochi, what are you doing? How long have you been sitting there doing nothing? Whose Pikmin's dying? Is it mine? It might be mine. Yeah, it is, apparently. Nope, hang on. Don't do that. I want you for other things. This is fine. Let's try and get this back. Which we can since we have a lot of strength. Oh boy, please don't do that. Please don't do that. You actually trying to steal it now. This is fine. Also my Pikmin are just on the ground apparently. Gonna go over this way, apparently. There's a lot of stuff. Just gonna use some of it. Also, thank you. Also, can I call my Pikmin? Yeah, we can actually do this. That's actually quite helpful. I'm gonna start using just as many of these as I can or something. Thirty seconds left? I don't know how helpful I can how much stuff I can do. I can get this maybe. But again, I don't know how helpful this will be. Also, I forgot I could ride Ochi. Which would have changed a few things probably. Is 210 fine? Maybe? Probably. Yep. <laughs> I was a little bit worried because of how it was going, but no, it was fine. I was doing too well. 
that there wasn't enough stuff to collect. Okay. Again, you've shown mastery in the art of Dendori. I leave you the rest. Leave the rest to you. Hmm. Off they go again. Thankfully, we recovered the castleway safe and sound. Impressive victory. Hopefully. <laughs> Making this day a little bit more productive. Bit by bit. Still have a whole area left to explore. And then clean out the underwater stuff as well. And then a cave or two. Something like that. Also, I need to get you back. Transport the castaway to the SS Beagle ASAP. Jeremy Nochi. I actually have to transport it, okay. And I'm far away from the base. 50% of area. Pretty decent. I really hope that they're going to go fast. I should have actually gone for winged Pikmin or something. They're not going to be fast enough. I really didn't think this through. For some reason I thought it was going to spit us out at our base. Also, the, the thing is right here, isn't it? Give me a second. Should have done that a little bit earlier. But at least it's not that far away. Let's call him back. It's not worth it. Almost, though. We could have had it back if I was just remembering that there was a base there. Okie dokie. Didn't rescue the castaway, but it's fine. We, we were close. Sparkly, I'm discovered. Fair bit. Crimson Banquet. Good watermelon. Foolish Fruit. Is a eggplant, of course. Stellar Extrusion. Emperor Whistle. Dawn Pestules. Pustules. Zest Bomb. Ring of Return Shield. <laughs> Mock Bottom. Fishy bed. 56% cleared. Lost 5 Pikmin. Or transporting stuff back. Captain Olimai is from Hokotate. Isn't he? Hokotate, I don't know. I hear the planet's quite well known for its veg vegetables. Apparently they're in de indescribably delicious. It's always been a dream of mine to... Uh, one day eat a genuine hock tape, uh, golden pick pick carrot. But they're so ex- They're so expensive. I haven't had the right occasion to justify it. Ah yes, golden pick pick carrots. Just talk about them make, uh, brings me back to my- To mother's kitchen and her amazing cooking. She'd blend them up in a mixer un until they were liquefied. Nutritious, delicious, and extremely efficient for consumption. This sounds a lot like that one video of Olma <laughs> blending up the pick pick carrots. She took all those beautiful, expensive carrots and just made and made juice. Does that even count as cooking? 